Semi truck driver is dead and a gay likes family loses their father's home. The big rig crashed through a house this morning after veering off the road. 10 News reporter Rachel Lucas says this isn't the first time a home there has been hit. A grizzly scene this morning as a semi truck ran off the road through a neighbor's home, crashing into this brick home that's really only feet away from the road. As you can see, the damage is so bad. The home has now been condemned. The family still unable to go inside to get many of their belongings. So you can see pieces of the semi truck are still here in the yard. We're told the truck driver died during the crash. Jonathan Harding from Jacksonville, Florida died on the scene. It's not clear why he crashed into the home, but tread marks leading up to the house show he didn't try to hit the brakes, leading police to believe he either fell asleep at the wheel or had a medical emergency. Neighbor David Hancock, who lives two houses down, heard the crash happen. I heard a noise. I checked there's a big truck through that house there, and uh, the cab was so big it went all the way in through the living room. A living room, luckily, no one was in. Now vacant, the homeowner spoke to us off camera and said her father lived in the home before he died a year ago. Unable to get inside because the floor is now caving in, they've only gathered a few belongings, like her father's favorite chair, a few pictures, and a little doll. This is the third time this block has become a crash scene. A familiar sight for Hancock, a Pepsi truck hit his home a little over a year ago. Thank God, wasn't nobody home. Now they're finally hoping that lawmakers will take note and change the speed limit on this roadway. In Galax, I'm Rachel Lucas, 10 News, working for you.